Hi, I'm back. Dolly's Utopia. I'm back. Um, I have more stuff to show you. I know you're probably thinking, I had no idea this woman had all this stuff. So, as you can see these little boxes here, I made these little cabinets. And they're just regular, look, dove soap boxes. And I covered them with cardstock paper, black and white cardstock paper. And I um, glued these little pearl beads onto it just to give it that look. So I thought these was cute because I kind of messed up the other little kitchen that I had. Um, the, the little cabinets that I had, they got messed up. Not me, my daughter messed them up. So that's that. Um, now I want to show you, let me move these out of the way. I like to show you this. I made this. This is for the kitchen. This is a kitchen cabinet. This is another tutorial that I got off of my froggy. Okay, so if you go to my froggy stuff, um, you're going to see all the tutorials that she has. She has so many. Okay, and they're all so nice. And some of them are so challenging. This was challenging. Um, as you can see, look, look. I made it out of this box here. And I just covered it with some white cardstock paper. Once again, I put some more pearl beads on it. Okay, so this is me creating my doll world. So you're going to make things and you're going to buy things. But I do enjoy making them. Okay, something else that I have. This goes in the living room. And then let me lift that up a little bit. Um, there we go. It won't stay though. I don't understand what's wrong with this webcam. This goes in Lizette's living room and I bought this for four dollars out of family dollar. You see the four dollars there? So this is like a shelf or a bookcase and I put her little belongings on here like her DVDs or CDs and stuff like that. Okay? Um, something else I want to show you is the curtain that my friend made for me. This is something, somebody made this for me. I didn't make this. Um, my friend Tanya was nice enough to make this doll curtain for me. And, oops, and she made this to go with it. It's like a little couch. It also had a little ottoman, but I can't find it, certain things. You can't find so I think this was so precious and so sweet that she made this for me. Um, other stuff I want to show you. Okay, I'm gonna move these things because stuff falling everywhere, as you can hear or see. All right. I bought these little things here from like the 99 cent store. Now I use these little. Um, things in the bakery set that I made for Amber. So I take these little pieces off and I put them onto the board that I've created for Amber. Um, Amber's Bake Shop. I can't talk straight. I'm sorry. Um, more stuff that I have. Uh, here we go. I bought this out of Michael's. The uh, what's that? That's a um, not a fabric store. Michael's, the arts and crafts store. I'm sorry, my brain is freezing. Um, and I want to use these little stickers for when I get ready to do things for Sahara's bridal shower or when we start preparing for her wedding because she is actually engaged. More stickers. Okay, I love these. You see these? These are gorgeous. Um, I want to use these when I get an opportunity to create a part scene. Um, I didn't take them out the pack and these are 3D stickers. Um, you see that? Um, and yeah, this is going to be real nice and fun. I've never done a part scene so, you know, that helps when you buy stickers and things like this. You might want to do a Valentine's Day episode with your doll so you can create a scene where you have these um, Valentine's Day little hearts. And I got these out of Walmart. And it's it says 54 
little pieces is in this pack. So you got the red hearts, you got the silver hearts, and you have the pink hearts. And this is just so cute. Here we go, more stickers. Stickers are nice. Um, let me see if I can fix it. I'm trying to make it stay. Sorry. It just won't stay for some reason. Okay. Maybe I should just leave it alone, right? Okay, here's another sticker. These are just pretty flowers. Things like that, if you can see it. Um, that I could probably use for one of the episodes. Or maybe something to decorate. Um... Sahara's bridal shower party. That might be nice to use these stickers. Then, you know, here go more pretty flowers. So this might be nice for her, her bridal shower. I mean, I'm just showing you how you can get real creative. And you just gotta think out of the box and stuff like that to do fun things. These are some pictures. I cut this out of a book. I want to put this in the Monster High house. Like, I kind of want to go with like maybe a Victorian themed Monster High house. Um, I actually made this one. I just cut this paper out and I put some pretty border paper around it. So I'm probably going to end up, you see that? And if you notice, it's the forest, okay? So I'm trying to stick with the theme of the Monster High um, theme. Okay, because they live in the forest. I bought this little miniature thing here from, I think, yeah, out of Hobby Lobby. Okay, and I believe it was only, how much was this? A dollar ninety-nine cents. So they two little Bibles, little black one and a white one. So I think these are cool. So that might be just about it that I do have Dolly Shatopia. I do I, I do happen to have a lot of stuff and I have all sorts of different types of materials and things that I buy like I got this lace so I'm gonna do stuff with it um, materials like if you watch one of, one of my tutorials I showed you how I made the doll dresses out of this stretchy fabric which I love um, and here's more of this like animal print <laughs> type of fabric is gorgeous but I use this in the Monster High um, living room um, so they have this like theme and it's like animal type thing with the big window so that's just about it that wraps it up um, I probably do have more stuff I wish I could show all my sets but that's that's just too much um, if you just watch let me show my face um dolly's utopia or anybody that's interested if you just watch my videos um a doll set um you'll see i have five videos that i made it's from doll set one two three four five and i'm showing you all of my doll sets and actually i showed two of the new ones that i made up in a, a previous video that i recorded today so yeah that's about it i'm pretty tired um it was fun making these videos so um i hope you like it dolly utopia and as you can see like if this is what you want to do it's a lot a lot of work and i'm out of breath because i have a two-year-old I can't stress to you enough how much that girl keeps me on my toes. Okay, so with that being said, I'm going to go and um, I'm going to upload these videos. Okay, so thanks for the request, um, Dolly Utopia, and have a good night.